everybody. It is Aaron here from Countryside Acres. We got the whole family in the van. Even mama. This will be a very first time for us. First time for us going out as a family to do some grocery shopping. We needed a few things and uh, yeah, normally we get a Yandex or something. If we're going farther from home, if we're walking, we've done it, but uh, nothing closer by. It is a beautiful spring feeling day. Plus three or four today, snow is melting. You can actually see water running down the side of the lane or side of the road, which is nice. We're getting past the cold, long, dark winter. All right, we've been here before. We've actually filmed quite a bit here, but the OK grocery store is here. We have not been in there yet, I don't believe. And that's where we're headed. <laughs> you find a toy. PG jeans. You having fun yet? Why? <laughs> it's just shopping. It's not even tractors. Hey, yesterday was funner, wasn't it? You like the tractors better? Yeah. Yeah, it's better than looking at clothes. <laughs> yeah. yeah. You too? I think I would rather. Did you know one of the commenters said that uh, the blue tractors are the favorite here? I think so too. Yeah, and I figured out why. Apparently, there's a show here that has uh, a little blue tractor on it. Kind of like we would have, like Thomas the Train or whatever. They have a show with a little blue tractor. So lots of kids like blue tractors. Huh, interesting, eh? <laughs> and your favorite color is? Blue. Or favorite tractor, anyway. Yeah, blue. blue. I could have videotaped you there too. <laughs> Somebody stole my baby. Oh. Where did Mama go? Oh, there she is. Ah, and the Russian dolls. That's hilarious. All three girls? You taking a picture or what are you doing? Nice. Okay, you should get up here and perform. Sing us a song. Why chest piece? Oh, I've no idea. Ooh, look at that picture, man. I wonder where that is. Beautiful. Oh, not that. The flowers were nice. Hi. So unfortunately, they have sensors on these escalators. Uh, quite often, I'll take an escalator with the stroller, just tip it back, and then uh, works no problem. The escalators here have a sensor on it, so the moment I went on that thing, it stopped suddenly, and I slammed my ankle into the step. It's pretty uncomfortable. So now I have to take the elevator every time while the kids and Mama take the escalator, and of course now we have to find each other because they're not in the same spot. They're here somewhere. She just looks so impressed. Half asleep. Pardon? Ah, five. Five o'clock. This store actually reminds me a little bit of like Mark Short Warehouse for some reason. A little bit of everything. <coughs> but no snow pants. Many times I forget that we YouTube everything. We just found bulk. Look at the size of that. And here, this is what I was talking about. We're used to buying things in big boxes. 
How many's in there? 164, 150, 136, 104. Yay! Are you excited? I am. <laughs> About such a little thing. Well, it's actually a big thing. <coughs> big package. Very good. Just get this one. Well, we gotta make sure we get the right size. I guess that's a number five. That'll work, eh? Yeah. All right, we're back at beautiful Switzerland Park. Now we got some new snow pants for Elias. We can go do some uh, skating. So we were here once upon a time with uh, for for a uh, what do they call it? A news conference. We did a news conference here. And we've always been meaning to go back because it's a beautiful park. So today we're gonna go check it out, part of it, and see if we can get the kids doing some skating. Hey, buddy. Hi. Can you wave. Can you say hi. Hi. <laughs> hey. You gonna climb up? Bye. It's too slippery. Uh -huh. <laughs> <Whoa>. <laughs> You're sliding all over. <laughs> so we've been talking about coming back to this park for quite a while. Beautiful day. It's a little nicer now, actually, yeah. now that spring's in the air. Where are you going? <laughs> Absolutely wonderful. So this is part of Switzerland Park on the other end. Oh, I don't know. I don't even think we're done at all yet. But huge park. But look at this vantage point. It's funny, hey? They have very few for guardrails. I'm thinking if this was in Canada, there would be a guardrail. Yeah. Because they're all so safety conscious. And I don't see any Russians on the bottom of the hill, so no guardrail needed. No trees will either hit one. <laughs> I guess. Boy, that's a long way down. Away from the edge. Beauty. Right here? I can see the dealer. Oh, yeah, people probably go tubing here. Oh, look at this little skinny track. Yeah. Then you'd have to walk all the way back up again, though. Seems like eating is all we do these days. But anyway, skating was closed right now, or it would be closed. We've got to wait an hour. So we came into this little building. Is that what they're doing? Yeah. Oh, yeah. They got a little Zamboni for that thing. There you go. So anyway, next door to the skating rink, they got this lovely place. Pizza and hot dogs. So, and juice. Which we thought was apple juice. What's apple juice, Eli? Yabloka suck. Yabloka suck. Yeah. But you didn't get. Do you have it? You don't have. What do you got? Grape. Grape? No cherry, I think. Is that what the official term for it? <laughs> <laughs> Anyway, it's still nice and light out. Kids are playing in the park for a little bit. It's well worth coming here and spending the day sometimes. It's a beautiful park. Having fun? Yeah, it's harder on these ones. They don't have tips like I'm used to. Everything he does and he enjoys, he does it well. Oh yeah. It's interesting. <laughs> it's true. Pretty good. 
I didn't know you knew how to skate. I kind of did. A little bit? Yeah. When's the last time you went skating? Manitoulin. That's been a while. Yeah. Well, when at Manitoulin? Where'd you go skating? At the in the front? At the in, front where we parked the van. Oh, in the field. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You're right. You made it back! <laughs> Is it fun? <laughs> yeah. All right, so we got them a push thing to push around. I can't skate. I would need one of those things. I haven't skated. Oh, I don't know when the last time I skated. I was probably like 18 years old. When's the last time you went skating? I don't know. Years and years and years ago. Long I, time I used ago? to. I was so bad at skating. I used to put volleyball, like those knee pads for ah, volleyball, yep. in my snow pants so that for when I knees. hit my knees, I at least had some. Yeah, 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 yeah. And I knew I was going to go down, but now I'm older and I usually fall the other way. <laughs> my my bottom isn't as cushioned. <laughs> no. Nope. So we're able to teach our kids lots of different things that we do, but we don't do many sports. Anissa doesn't, neither do I. Uh, I mean, I don't mind kicking a ball around with the kids, but that's about it. So they learn those things elsewhere and uh, from friends or whatever. And now they're older siblings, like Wes is pretty good at skating, so he can teach the other ones. I woke up in the middle of the night mm -hmm, na, na, na. And I wondered how you're always right It gets me I couldn't see what you saw in me But you showed me how to believe Still gets me When I look back I can see you're hiding Waiting for a moment to step in And I'll never understand how you saw it coming Oh, bye It is hard to share my thoughts Beautiful lights So this is at Switzerland Park They've got the whole world right here Wes is having fun Anyway, it's a nice little skate rink Pretty small <laughs> You having fun? <laughs> That's when I would wipe out, somebody would wave at me. Yeah. Lose my balance. That should do good. She is, yeah. He wants to try skating with me. Falling apart Open just to get 
The one thing that's great about kids is they make friends just like that. It's amazing. So Eli just came in, dropped off his little yellow thing, and started pushing this kid around. They don't speak the same language, but they're now best friends. So. That kid reached out his hand and they high-fived a little while ago and then he dropped off his yellow thing and now they're playing together. Heading the wrong way, but that's all right. Somebody will spin them around. I think Mama's about ready to go home. It's getting cold standing here, eh? Hey? Maybe one day, not today. All good? You had a good fall? Feel alright though? It's a good thing you got off and you did. The Zamboni's are gonna run you over. All done for tonight. It's all beautiful here, all lit up. Look like palm trees, at least those ones do. <laughs> Pretty quiet now. It's uh, what, almost 8 o'clock. Thursday evening. Kids worked up a good sweat. Skating? Coffee cake. Hey? Said there's coffee cake. Coffee cake? Mm hmm. Mmm. Sounds good, me. Look at all far these light strands, though. Hey? Look at all far these light strands. Yeah, it's a long strand. Looks nice all lit up, though, eh? Yeah. That's such a beautiful park. There must be a cable. Otherwise, the lights. Oh, yeah, I'm sure it is. It stretched the wire. I'm sure it is. Anyway, another wonderful day. Met a nice young gentleman. Never to caught his name, actually. He was pretty chatty. He was uh, eager to practice his English to me. And uh, so we got chatting there on the side of the ice rink. Nice kid. So, yeah, if you're watching this, thanks for the chat. Other than that, it was an eventful evening. Or an uneventful evening. It was fun. I really like these it was lights. enjoyable. Hey? I really like the lights. Yeah, they're nice. Like not just on the trees, but these ones across. I said wherever we end up, I would mind some in the trees. Yep. Really yep. Nice. nice area like this. So, anyway, it's interesting how many people do speak, especially the young people who do speak English. A lot of them still will tell you no, but uh, he was pretty eager to practice, which is nice. So now we're going to go find our van somewhere out here and call it a night. We got these beautiful arches here. And we have parked down the road there somewhere. So once again, I hope you all enjoyed touring around with us. And um, please like it. Give her a thumbs up, give her a thumbs down, like, share, subscribe, especially share. It's the best help you can give us. A lot of people ask how they can help, and that's that's by far the best thing you can do for us is share the videos. We appreciate that kind of support. It helps us to grow the channel and reach more people, show more people what it's like over here. So God bless you guys. If you have any comments, drop them down below, of course. Shoot us an email if you need to. And we look forward to seeing you in the next one. God bless you. Hey everybody, Aaron here again from Countryside Acres. We are back at Switzerland Park again today. We are doing a documentary with Constantine today. So Wes is in the interview right now. Getting grilled. <laughs> Tough questions. So stay tuned for that. I don't know when it'll be out. Probably in the next week or two, I would think. But I think you'll enjoy a little bit more in-depth of our life here in Russia and our reasons for coming here, moving here, why we wish to stay here. All the goodies. He's gonna get some footage of us here today, uh, just as a family. And uh, yeah, hope you enjoy. Let's get out, we can leave this city. Let's drive to the open air. Yeah, the countryside is so pretty. With the wind blowing in your hair. We can look back someday.
Standing in the middle of the night when the stars are bright. 